Jane Tannehill and her husband Alan farm at Killeg near Colrain, where Jane runs her flock of pedigree rouge sheep. Their proper name is Rouge de Loup, and they originated in the Loire region of France. The first imported rouge came to Northern Ireland in 1986. Renowned for their rich milk, the rouge was originally kept as a dairy sheep, producing French cheese. They are now primarily raised for their meat. The rouge sheep is of medium length, has a polled head, meaning no horns, and has a unique red head and legs. The breed is promoted for their easy lambing ability, maternal ability and high meat to bone ratio. This is the Sunrise flock of 32 ewes established in 2002 and is run alongside the family's herd of dairy cows. These lambs were born around the 20th of January and repeats were born approximately 17 days later. Most of these ewes lambed down with twins. In fact, two ewes this year had quads. A ewe having four lambs is not something that Jane wants, as it is very sore on the ewe. The lambs are being vaccinated against clostridial disease and pasteurellosis, which are diseases sheep can be susceptible to. Clostridial disease is picked up from the spores in the soil, and pasteurellosis is a bacterial infection which causes pneumonia in sheep, both of which can be fatal. This is one of the ewes who had four lambs. She is now seven years old and has produced six crops of lambs, including a reserve female champion at Carlisle. The lambs are given a two mil dose subcutaneously, meaning injected under the skin. This is their second shot, completing the vaccination course. The gimmers, meaning one-year-old females, are receiving their yearly booster as well. Jane also gives the flock a vitamin boost with a drench. Jane is very vigilant regarding flock health management. These lambs with the white faces are crossbreeds, a rouge mother and a beltex father. Jane says that these crossbred lambs have the best of both worlds. Extra muscle added by the Beltex sire and plenty of milk and good mothering ability from the Rouge mother. Jane is experimenting with the crossbreeds as the Rouge Society introduced registered Rutex, a Rouge mother with a Beltex, Texel or Dutch Texel father. These first cross rams are proving a popular choice for some flock owners wanting a mixture of both breeds. We will see the Beltex breed later. These ram lambs being weighed will go to the factory late May or June if Jane feels they are not good enough to be sold as pedigree rams for breeding. Jane is weighing her lambs as her flock is a member of the Signet Performance Recording Program. These lambs are being weighed to send more data for analysis. They were weighed at birth and will be scanned at approximately 21 weeks for muscle and fat depth. This recording enables Jane to keep improving the genetics of her flock, selecting for desirable traits. This is one of Jane's top ram lambs, Sunrise Regal. He was born as a single on the 21st of January and he is now 10 weeks old, weighing 46 kilograms. She has great hopes for him in the Rouge classes at the shows this summer, and especially at Balmoral Show. Balmoral Show in May is the big one everyone wants to win. Jane thinks this is the best ram she has ever bred. He has got great length, a lovely tight skin, excellent muscling, and very correct on his legs. A nice all-round sheep, full of character. This lamb might be sold for breeding or may be retained for use within her own flock. He could be worth over a thousand pounds, 